We are here in front of Congress Member Judy Chu's office in Claremont, California. She's a Democrat, and we were here today to tell her as constituents that we want her to vote for funding the border wall in order to open the government, stop the Democrat government shutdown. We've discovered, we were told someone would be in the office. Today is Thursday, January 17th, 2019, Claremont, California, and the office is locked up. Here are our constituents. Hi, I'm Lori. I work in Upland. I pretty much verbatim what um, um, Robin just said. And of course, I also want to know, maybe if she's not in her office, she's probably someone in Puerto Rico enjoying a nice uh, getaway <laughs> at a $400 a night suite <laughs> at taxpayer's expense. So, uh, to uh, repeat, just basically ask her to support the building of the wall. And we're going to leave the sign here. I'm Alexandra, and I live right here in Claremont, and uh, I just want that wall so we can secure our borders, because so many American lives are lost uh, to criminal illegal aliens, and it's not that we don't like uh, immigrants, we like legal immigrants, so build that wall. I'm Robin, I also live in Claremont. Uh, my concern is that Judy Chu states that uh, the whole need for this uh, Trump wall uh, just boils down to xenophobia and I say that's not true Judy Chu it is not xenophobia that's driving the border wall uh, it's concern again to secure our borders for safety and it's just basic responsibility of the government to secure the border and additionally Trump is only asking for five billion dollars for 235 miles and that sounds pretty reasonable, and it's at the request of Homeland Security, they, uh, they would like the wall. A, be a barrier, fence, wall. Call it what you will. Wall. I like wall. I'm Emily, and I'm wondering if Congresswoman Chu believes in the sovereignty of our nation. If she does, then she will do everything possible to get our borders secured, and that includes building the wall. We California taxpayers pay over $25 billion a year funding illegal aliens. That would certainly pay for the wall. So she needs to decide, is she an American who believes in our sovereignty or not. If she doesn't believe in it, she needs to resign. Uh, yeah, there's 23,000 American citizens have been murdered and killed in the last five years by illegal aliens. So Judy Chu has blood on her hands, which she will not take responsibility for. And I think that we should be back in our president, build that wall, make it tall, deport them all, Trump 2020. <laughs> okay, so as we said, the door is locked. We expected staff members to be in Congress Member Judy Chu's office. But we've got some information. Let's show her what we're going to leave under the door for her. Keep Americans safe. We love ICE. We love law enforcement. And America first. So we're going to slide that under the door. Our calling cards. Our calling cards. And then we'll leave a sign. They can see we want our border secured. And this is a little picture of an actual fence. So we're leaving them with a piece of the fence, build the wall. <laughs>